Hey guys, DIY with Elle here, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to DIY a geometric feature wall. This is the before, and here is the after. What an effect! You will need different complementary paint colors as well as paint brushes and roller sets. I'm using the Hamilton's Perfection Velo Roller because it gives an ultra smooth finish and I'm using different solvent and water-based paints. I'm also using the masking tape from Hamilton's to create my lines and geometric shapes. Here I am just going for it and placing the lines and triangles in different areas and stepping back every now and then just to check if it's flowing alright. When I'm sticking the masking tape to the wall, I'm also firmly pressing down with my hands on the edges, making sure that there's no parts that are sticking up because that will limit the paint bleeding through when I eventually get to painting the wall. It's looking good. Next step is painting. And as I said, I absolutely love this roller. It's just the perfect size for these size triangles in different colors. So I'm painting each triangle in different colors. I marked out what colors go where just to have an overall feel. And then I just went for it and had a lot of fun painting the different sections. Now it's time to add a pop of color to my complementary colors just to bring this geometric wall back to life. I decided on this gorgeous color just to break up the grays, whites and silvers. Of course, I used a paintbrush to get to those hard to reach places where the sponge roller just can't get to. I'm also applying two to three coats with the color and one to two coats with the other neutral colors. It's looking good but still messy because the tape is still there. Time to reveal my masterpiece. Oh, that is so satisfying. I'm gently pulling back the masking tape to reveal some crisp lines. And if any bleeding occurred, I just tidied it up with a bit of paint. This DIY geometric feature wall is now complete and it looks amazing. I just love the crisp white lines that the tape lines left behind and it really makes the geometric shapes stand out. What a fun, easy DIY way to turn a boring wall in your home into a striking, modern and fun piece of art. There's the finished home office makeover and I couldn't be more happy with how it turned out. So follow me at DIY with Elle for more home DIY and decor projects. And remember, keep smiling and DIYing.